Hi, my name is Deirdre Sullivan and I am going to read a little bit from um, The Art of the Glimpse, edited by Sinead Gleeson, which is the Red Line Book Festival book for 2020. Um, my story in the collection is called Black Spot. You pass it always on your way to work and there are flowers, petrol station bouquets all in cellophane, carnations, baby's breath and hot pink daisies. Sometimes there are roses from a garden, or the wilder sort. Marigolds and buttercups and clover, little bunches picked and wrapped in kitchen paper, made at home. Bunches added, never cleared away, piles of them are rotting. Petals gone and stalks melted onto colour drain with time. It makes you sad. It makes you sad to see the care and lack of care at once all sellotape together. In your little Mazda with the heater blasting window mist at full cry. It ruins your skin. You moisturise but dryness it collects around the nose and when you scratch it's red, not raw but sore. You look like you've been crying when you get to work a lot. In the face but never in the eyes. You live far out the country in a house you could afford. You drive when it's dark and arrive when it is getting bright. You leave work when it's dark and get home darker. You stay late most of the time. You have to. People never pick their children up on time and then there's tidying and sorting art supplies and things. Construction paper, glue. You don't use glitter now. It is forbidden. It gets everywhere. Karen, the manager, found some in her knickers two Mother's Days ago and said no more. Karen's younger than you are. She hasn't worked in the crash for half as long, but when Michelle retired, she took the reins. You wonder if you'd spoken up, could you have? What you could have done to be that woman, the one who makes things happen for herself. You do not feel like that is ever you. When Karen tells you to do things, you resent it sometimes and she feels it. You used to get on better. It's not that you don't listen, it's that she's younger. It's that she doesn't always do her best. She expects you to do the grunt work and you don't get paid enough to like that. Every morning, every evening, flowers. You look at them. You always think, one day I'll stop the car, get out and tidy. It would be a nice thing to do, but there are reasons not to get involved. You don't know who died here. You don't know who left flowers and for whom. You want a cup of tea. It's getting late. Maybe in the summer when it's nice again, then maybe you could do it. When it's nice again. It has been years and still the flowers rot and you do nothing. 42 deaths changed to 43. Then 47. Accident black spot. Um, that's from The Art of the Glimpse, which is the Red Line Book Festival book for 2020. Um, and I am delighted to be in it. Um, I will be doing two events with the Red Line Book Festival this year. Um, the first one is a conversation with the author of Why the Moon Travels, Owen de Vardoon, and that's going to be available online on Tuesday the 13th of October at 7pm. And the second event I'm going to be doing is a, a conversation with Therani Grifa, who wrote the beautiful A Ghost in the Throat, and that's going to be on Friday the 16th of October at 8pm. I uh, hope to see you there. Thank you.